is a story that gets told in some of the contemporary documents of Stephen Gerard working at Bush Hill, taking charge of that hospital, if that's really what we can call it, of, of dealing with a patient who's sick with yellow fever and of that patient vomiting all over Stephen Gerard. It's, it's, it's a remarkable image. One of the wealthiest, most influential men in the city, in the nation, has put his own business interests aside in order to deal with people who are throwing up on him. That's, that's an extraordinary, extraordinary moment. And he just goes on with his work. Again, Stephen Gerard absolutely could have left, could have put himself and his, uh, 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 his own world at personal safety, could have put that uh, first, chooses instead to apply his own talents. He's not a scientist. He's not going to figure out what causes the disease. He's not going to figure out um, all of the medical implications of it. But he knows how to organize and he knows how to run operations. So he takes charge of this hospital. He turns it from a mess into something that actually functions. Uh, and it's a remarkable effort, uh, a heroic effort.